Oh my gosh, hello guys. So I decided to do a live stream today and originally I was going to have it be at the top of the hour, but then I got lazy and I wanted to get food and I just decided to do it now instead. So we're going to wait a little bit, let people come in. I'm going to tweet this out like usual. And we're going to have fun today. I'm going to be doing, well, I'll tell you what I'm going to be doing in a second while I get my life together. <laughs> Let me just make sure the stream is actually working. Looks like it is. So that's good. I clicked on the wrong video because I'm trash. <laughs> yes. Anyway. Yay. Okay, so now I can finally actually tweet it out like a professional. Look at me. Look at me go. Oh, there goes my <laughs> Professional. Oh, my God. Here we go. <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't even know if anyone's here yet. But I'm here, I'm queer, and we're ready to go. We're going. We're not ready to go, we're going. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Okay, so there we go. It is officially tweeted out. Professional at its finest. <clears throat> so... Looks like no one's here yet. Um, that's fine. It's fine. I'm just gonna be so basically. I'll just say what I'm doing in this in this live stream. Um, honestly, it's uh, it's co National Coming Out Day, and I forgot about that because you know we gays just have so much going on in our lives, and so I decided to read a BL manga today. And today I'm going to be reading, be reading uh, Antique Bakery by Fumi Yoshinaga. Super excited. I've never read it before. I've never seen the anime. And I thought this would be fun. So we're going to do that. I'm going to take off the dust jacket because that <laughs> is super annoying. We don't want that. And yeah, here's the naked book. Look at the naked boys. You love it. You love it. You love to see it. Love to see it. Yes. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to read it. I've only read a few of her other stories. Um, never, never read anything else by her. So, well, I have. I'm tired, girl. Listen, I'm tired. Um, I've only read, let's see, the first volume of Oku. And then I've also read, uh, Garden Dreams by her. And they're both fantastic. So I'm really excited to read this. Uh, this is about a bakery and the gay boys that populate it, because that's important, because gay boys love bakeries. <clears throat> so right off the bat, opening it up, we get a boxing character, which I wasn't expecting. I didn't know about this. I'm excited. We love a boxing boy. So let's just read. So I hope you can grab a manga, grab a snack. And just enjoy and read with me. Here we go. Page one. Oh my god, we have a confession on the first page. Wow. Cool. She, Fumi Oshinaka, she gets right to it. She is like, nope. We are going. We're going all in. She know, You know exactly what you're getting into. That's great. <coughs> Wow, that confession was the best, though. That was so honest. Also, he called him a totally straight, regular guy, which that's a trope that happens a lot in BL. <clears throat> I, I like this so far. <laughs> Oh, 
Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? Wow, that is not where I was thought it was going, but okay, homophobia. We hate to see it. Although I'm sure it's closeted homophobia because that's usually what it is. <laughs> cool. Awesome. I'm a little confused with all the uh, flashbacks now. That's fine. We're getting to the boxing action. Yes. Oh, shit. Well, yeah, this is already getting real. That's the thing I love about um, uh, Fumio Shinaga. Her manga tends to discuss topics that are, like, real-life shit, and I like that. I like how real she gets, so we're already getting to the realness already. We're, like, ten pages in. <clears throat> Oh, hi, Melissa. How are you? I'm, I guess, I don't know if you saw the beginning of the stream, but I'm reading uh, Antique Bakery. So, yes, first time reading this series, and I'm, I'm enjoying it so far. It's, it's already getting real. Already real. <laughs> <clears throat> Hi Art Tech, how are you? Sorry, I'm in I'm in I'm in the reading zone, so I'm kind of like I'm gonna be quiet for a little bit, but 
feel free to grab a manga and read with me if you want. Just uh, just having a chill chill stream today. I do want to say I love the artwork in this. Her artwork is just fantastic. I love how Fumi Oshinaga draws everything, especially her character design. So great. <clears throat> oh, that's actually, um, so I'm going to highlight your comment for a second. It's actually funny that you mentioned that, Melissa, because um, I pre-ordered it, so I have it. Um, I haven't started reading it yet. I, I need to read the other volumes. I technically still only have volume one. I know I'm crazy. I pre-ordered it because I just needed it. I needed to have it. Um, and I'm, I'm going to buy volumes two through four later. But, yeah, I own it now, so I'm looking forward to reading that. I guess I could show you the other manga that I got because I got a few others, too. Um, I also got the last volume of Demon Prince of Momochi House. So, yay. I think I still need 15, though. I missed that one. Um, I thought volume 15 was the last one. It's not. I thought it was. Um, so now I have almost the whole series, I think. And then I also picked up, the last volume I picked up is uh, Prince Freya volume 3. So that came out last week, and I pre-ordered these. And now I'm going to read these as well. Maybe I'll do a reading vlog for Prince Freya. I'm not sure. Or maybe just a live stream or something. We'll see. We'll see what I do. <sighs> Yay. Oh, and also, um, happy Thanksgiving as well. Uh, my brother's actually half Canadian, so that's awesome. So, yeah, I hope you have a nice dinner. Thank you for joining us. Yay, I'm glad you en are enjoying Sweat and Soap. I'm so excited to hear your thoughts on it. I love that series. I need to get volume two and three as well. So, yeah. Oh, cool. I actually, my friend really loves this series. Um, he loves the uh, the game for the Gaiden no Chi. Uh, my friend Morgan. So I need to read this as well. Um, that's his Brit find though. Those are out of print. So that's awesome. Okay, I'm going to get back to reading because I want to find out more about these beautiful women because they're, they're beautiful. I'm also going to eat because I didn't eat lunch, so ignore my food. Hmm. Okay, cool. I like these characters so far. We have one woman who used to be kind of like a rebel, like a tomboy kind of character, and the other one who admired her and always wanted to be her friend. So that's cool. I like I like where this is going. 
hopefully this is going in in Yuri places. I don't know if it will. That would be awesome. I just I just love love in general, so that would be great, especially on National Coming Out Day. Come on, guys. Come on. Oh, I think it is. Oh, I think it is, though. Oh, my gosh. She wants to see her again. Gay. Gay, gay, gay. Gay, 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 gay. <laughs> I, I'm loving this. <laughs> oh, and one of them is a teacher, but, like, they're, they're friends. Like, they're adults, so... I mean, it's technically a teacher, so if you have that, you like that, there are adults that are, you know, in the workplace, so, I mean, they're not, they're not in the same job, but, yeah. Drama. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> okay, I already shipped them, though. I already shipped them, because we love to see it. Oh, this sounds really cute. Oh, my God. She's, like, thinking about her and talking about going to lunch and getting dessert. And it's really cute. Oh, and I'm sorry. I've been ignoring the chat. Um, yay. I Yes, I do know about the, the game on Steam. I need to check it out. I want to play it. Um... And then I also need to read the rest of classmates too. I'll do that eventually. I'm glad you love it because I love I love her artwork. They're fantastic. Also, have a wonderful night. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, I'll I'll highlight this one too because why not? Uh, cool. That's amazing. I'm excited. I can't wait to read that series. It looks so cute. I'm so excited to read it. Okay, back to the lesbians, <laughs> which might they might not be lesbians. I don't know. I'm just I perpetuate sexualities onto characters. <laughs> Probably not the best thing to do on National Coming Out Day, but you know what? I have fun. It's fine. <laughs> oh no. Okay. I thought it was going to go in a different direction, but it's not, so that's good. Oh my god, all this talk of food is making me hungry. Good thing I have food at the ready, but, you know. I should have known with the title, but it's a good thing I have food at hand, so that's good. <laughs> oh my gosh this is really I like this so far I like this a lot
Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting hungry. Yep. I knew this would happen. That's why I have food. So that's good. Oh, yeah, that's actually a good idea, actually. Sorry. Um, I don't have volume uh, three yet because it comes out on the 20th, but I should read that on stream because I love it. I love it. Um, Rereading Monster and the Beast would be a good idea, actually. But I don't know. I wanted to read this because I got it in the mail for a really good price. So, you know, got to read, got to read. <clears throat> All right, and that was chapter one. I like it so far. I like the characters. It's really interesting. Um, I definitely, I, I, I like it. It's good. Also, the art is beautiful. And I love the, it's very, obviously, very, like, Jose and Shoujo-y. So that's nice. I just, I like it. I like it a lot. <laughs> also, this is totally me when I eat sweets, so yes. <laughs> All right, I kind of like the dynamic that these two characters have because one is a um, one's a head chef and the other one's like an apprentice, so he calls him master. And um, they're they're just talking about like baking food and he's like tasting his desserts, which that in itself is a that's an innuendo right there. But yeah, I like this a lot. <laughs>
Oh my god, I love, okay, I love, like, the salesman guy in this. I don't know his name yet. I, I'm bad with names, but um, he's fantastic. <laughs> because, um, hold on. He, he's basically um, just trying to sell his cakes. And the way he talks to people is, like, so realistic to if you're in a bakery. Like, yes, I like it a lot. Again, I just love, I love, I love all of like the innuendos in this. It's just, it's so great. It's so great. It's so clever. Oh. 
Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm eating as I read this and the mouth is still watering. So that tells you how good this is. Like, I love food and manga. I love reading about it. Mm. The classic wiping off the, the cream off your face. Mm. Chef's kiss. Love it. Love to see it. That's why I ship them. Ship these ladies forever. Ship them forever. <laughs> I love them. Oh my god. I was expecting like I wasn't expecting like a Yuri romance in this. I love it. <clears throat> <laughs> oh my gosh. And then the commentary of the guys talking about them. The best. I love this. They said it. <laughs> they said it just like I did when I first met them. They said it. I mean, I mean, literally. I My camera's not very good. I'm sorry. But they said it. Mm -hmm. I ship it. Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Aisha. Yay. Ah, finally, you came just in time. I'm reading Antique Bakery, and I'm shipping so hard. 
Oh my god. And um, yes, hi. <laughs> I hope you're doing well. Yes. Um, the ones that I'm shipping, I'm going to go back to it. Um, and of course, we just found out that one of them is married, of course, but I'm shipping the girls. I ship them so hard. I ship them, ship, ship, ship. Um, I'm the captain today, shipping, shipping. <clears throat> oh no, that went down the wrong way. Ah, I'm okay. I'm fine. I don't need to breathe. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I'm fine. Mm. Damn. <clears throat> I hate when that happens. Damn. Dang it. Well, I finished chapter two, and I still ship. I still ship. Oh, my God. Also, look how fucking cute this is. So fucking cute. <clears throat> Dang it. That stupid water went right down the windpipe. <sighs> oh, that's funny. She says she can't breathe, just like me. Girl, relatable. We're sisters. I know, the food always tries to kill me. Like, as I read food manga, I would just, it's a dangerous battle that we play. Oh my god. <laughs> I love this man. She literally just like she she just said like two sentences to this guy and he's like marry me. <laughs> Relatable. <clears throat> oh my god. I love this. This is so great. Oh my god. Oh my god, these time skips though. They what? <laughs> I just flipped the page and it's like 22 years later. So are we going to go through their kids' lives? What's happening? What is this? Is this like is this an alien manga? <laughs> what? <clears throat> oh my gosh. Girl, if he was eating one cake a day for a month, he would not look like 
like this. Like he would he would not look like that. Mm -mm. Girl, that is that is a lie. That is a lie. <laughs> it's fine though. Oh. Okay. I guess it does say that he just tasted the cakes. So I guess he's been buying cakes and eating one bite and then throwing the rest away like a sociopath would. But, girl, I couldn't. <laughs> I would be like, that's gone in two minutes, bitch. <laughs> Oh, they got married. That's so random. That is so random. I mean, I like this, but that's so random that they're like, that the one guy was like, marry me. Flip the page. 22 years later, they're married. Man, Fumi Yoshinaga goes, she goes quick. She's like, I'm not wasting any time. No wasting any time, girl. I wish that other manga were like that sometimes. I won't say anything, but I just wish it. <laughs> Where are we at? Wait, 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 wait. Girl, Fumi Oshinaka's a queen. She knows, she knows how to how to make it happen. Hmm, excuse me. Also, hi, Shay. Thank you for joining me. I'm reading Antique Bakery by Fumi Yoshinaga. I love it. I'm, I'm freaking out. <laughs> Stuff's happening. There's a marriage proposal in volume one, like chapter three, you know, normal stuff. Then they time skip 22 years. You know, it's fine. <clears throat> <sighs> I, it's not even, I just, I'm, I'm reading a manga about food and I'm getting flustered. <laughs> God, that's the real tea. Hmm. The innuendos in this series are so great. Although, that's actually not great. Because... Never mind, I'm not gonna, yeah. But I just, I love that they talk about food. And it's like, they talk about the food, but they're not actually talking about the food sometimes. Anyway, anyway. <clears throat> Yay! I'm glad you're enjoying Sweat and Soap, Melissa. I need to buy up to Volume 5 as well. I still only have read Volume 1, so I'm behind. <clears throat> now I have the hiccups. Girl. God, food manga, give me the hiccups, bitch. Mm. Damn it. <laughs> oh. 
I mean, to be fair, I am eating while I'm reading about food, but there's some, you know, something going on in my brain that's telling me it's a hiccup. <laughs> And I totally just read that whole page over again. <laughs> also, this man is 52, and um, he's also a daddy, so. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I mean, 50 is a little much for me, but I'll read about it. <laughs> Okay, I love him. I love him. I don't even know your name, sir, but I love you. I love you. I love you, love you, love you. Um, he was a private investigator, and there was a child that got kidnapped, and he, like, didn't sleep and kept working all week without coming home. Oh, I love him. Oh, my God. They don't make them like that anymore. <clears throat> oh my god i love the comedy in this manga too i love the comedic timing it's great oh, you just gotta read it yourself to find out what i'm talking about but it's good Yeah, boy, you show him your cakes, mm, girl. He's married. <laughs> I don't care. You still show him your cakes. Oh my god, Ono is the best. I love him. I love his bull crap, it's so great.
I mean, girl, he, he did. He showed him his cakes right there. Look at it right there. He showed them to him. Mm, look at all that cream. Okay, it is now confirmed that he has, in fact, been eating the cake, and he still looks like a bodybuilder that I want to sit on me. <laughs> so, I don't know how that magic works in Japan, but apparently it does, because, yes. <laughs> <clears throat> Oh my god, I love sherbet. I miss sherbet. Sherbet? 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 I, I need to stop saying that word or I'll never say it again. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's great. I love I love his his smile. Yes, he's so creepy. I love it. Um yeah, it said they said sherbet, sherbet. Like yeah, it's like sorbet, yes, but yeah, sherbet. So yeah. <clears throat> it might be something different than I'm thinking of, but oh well. And now we're back to chapter four with the boxing man. So we're going to find out more about him. That's cool. I'm assuming anyway. <clears throat> sure. I don't know how much longer I'm going to do this. Um, I mean, it's, I, I'm only halfway through and it's been an hour. And I don't know if I want to be here for two hours. So I may just read one more chapter and then finish up. But... Yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying this so far. So, are you guys reading anything? I know Shay said she was reading a book, and Melissa's reading uh, volume five of Incurable Case of Love. So, that's cool. Yes, I hope you're enjoying them.
Ooh, she is beautiful. Ooh, she is pretty. I like her. She is pretty. Yes. <clears throat> I just love looking at Fumi Oshiana's art, honestly. Oh my god, that sounds amazing. Yeah, once again, the food in this manga just looks beautiful and amazing. I love it. <clears throat> I love these names, though. Thunder Onizuka. Oh, I love boxing and men fighting. Yes. <laughs> we love to see it. <clears throat> <laughs> Who goes to a bakery and orders water? My god. He's obviously after something something else, if you know what I mean. <clears throat> Yeah. Mm. Ooh, Chase reading reading a vampire book. That sounds amazing. I I love, and I also love banter, so I'm looking forward to hearing more thoughts about that. Also, thank you for joining me, Shay. I appreciate it. So, yes, I will. I will come to your your stream when you do it the next time. If I'm if I'm off, because I'm working all the time. But yeah, you know, if it happens, if the stars align, we'll we'll I'll be there. <coughs>
Yay, I'm glad you're reading uh, Silver Spoon Asia. I really need to read that series, um, but I, I haven't bought it yet, so I'm not gonna read it for now. Um, but I'm, I'm curious about that one. I hope you enjoy it. Mm. Oh, the ageism is real, though, God. I gotta remember, it's just fiction. It's fine. And toxic masculinity. <laughs> That's another check off the list, too. Gotta love it. Yeah, I do like this though. It's cute. I really like the boxing couple in this too, Toru and the other the girl. I don't know her name because <laughs> I I don't think they've said it yet. Unless I don't know. I don't remember. But I like them, they're like cute together. <laughs> Namiko, they finally said her name. Okay, there it is. Oh, this is really cute. I love it. Oh my god. So they have like a history together and she's pregnant and he's a boxer who is really, really passionate about his, his career. And he says that he's going to be keep keep doing boxing and also take care of the baby. Oh, girl, I love this. This is so cute. Oh, so cute. I love them. Oh, my God. So cute. That's so funny, though, that, like, I picked this up expecting, like, oh, this is going to be, like, a, I mean, it is a gay manga, obviously. But, like, the first two couples that we've talked about are 
um, a lesbian couple and now a straight couple, but it's still adorable. I love it. I don't care. Love is love. Everyone who deserves love, and I love it. It's just funny. I like it, though. <laughs> Oh, so cute. Oh, I love them. <laughs> also, just in case you wanted to know, that's water. So, even water is beautiful. <laughs> All right, I think I only have like two more chapters. Can I read the last two chapters? I probably can. I probably can't. I'm going to eat a little more, though, but I'm, I'm probably going to do that. Because why not? <laughs> God, I love her facial expressions so much. So this guy is like, I quit my job today. I'm thinking of starting a bakery, and that's his parents. Mm. God, so great. This is so funny. I love it. <clears throat> Ooh. I'm I'm shipping again already. The die is cast. Here we go. <laughs> oh, they're the pe they're the couple with the with the history, with the homophobic history. Oh. Something's gonna happen. I can't wait. <laughs> Yay, I'm glad you finished in case of love. Yay. I hope you liked it. Um and I hope you like under undercover bromance. I've heard really good things about that. So that's exciting.
Oh my god, I love him. This. <laughs> I don't know if you can read it. He says, I am a gay of demonic charm. This. This. Very this. God, I love it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <gasps> mm. Mm. I'm ready <laughs> Yes. I mean he was still he was still hot when he looked like a nerd, but that hits Girl, <laughs> you probably got fired for making other straight men crazy over you again, didn't you? Girl, every day. <laughs> oh, I love him. I love Ono oh so much. I love him so much. God. Just, just, just touch my chin, please. <laughs> mm. Okay, I also love that we're kind of discussing uh, mental health as well in this um, because, um, yeah, uh, triggers for attempted suicide, I guess. But <sighs> see, if this is the thing about Fumi Yoshinaga. She like she like grabs you with the characters, and then she's like, "Bitch, this is real life. Real shit's happening right now." And I love it. Oh, she's so great. <clears throat>
God, I wish I had Ono's power to make every man crazy for me. I don't. <laughs> but I wish I did. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, okay. <clears throat> uh, bye, Shay. Thank you for joining me. Have a good night. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, hello. I'm just reading um, Antique Bakery and we're just chilling, reading some manga, grab a book, grab something to read and just chill with us. That's all we're really doing. And I'm reacting to it sometimes, but yes. Thank you for joining me. Oh, the shade, though. The shade. Mm. I, he might be lying, but the shade. He basically was like, if you hadn't dubbed me back then, I wouldn't be living this free lifestyle right now. And I wasn't even really able to recognize you anyway. Girl, the shade. Fucking flawless bitch. Get it, girl. You just... Mm, I love him. <laughs> Oh. 
Bye, Melissa. Thanks for joining me. Have fun watching 90 Day Fiance. I love you. I'm almost done reading, by the way. I'm like almost to the next chapter. So I'm going to end this pretty soon. But I, I'm enjoying myself. So, yes. <gasps> oh my god, cosplay? I wish, girl, I wish. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I was hoping so he got like a like a maid cafe uniform for a female worker and his uh his only other employee was like, "Oh, I'm afraid of women, so you can't hire her." And he starts bawling like a baby. God, straight men, I swear to god. Can't live with them. They be crying. <laughs> <clears throat> I I love this so much. I love it. Oh my God, I love the interview process for this guy. Oh my God. So he shows Ono the new, like, um, the boxing kid. Um, and he's like, is he your type? And he goes, no. And he's like, okay, you're hired. God, I love it. I love it so much. So fucking great. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna read this because I love it. Oh, no, no, no. He's no ordinary gay. He's a de demonically charmed gay. Unspeakably gay. A legendary gay. He's, he's scored with every man he's ever found pleasing. And he's, his mere presence transforms the kitchen into a stage of horrid romance. I am living, <laughs> I am living, <laughs> I'm legendary gay, <laughs> like a Pokemon, yes, battle music, let's go.
Girl, I wish I had a guy who could tell me I had the cake of all cakes. Yes. The sponge cake at the base is just moistened. It's literally soaked with this sweet, sour syrup, and it's delicious. The innuendos are real. Just saying. <laughs> oh, no, I got cheese on my book. Dang it. Oh. I shouldn't be eating chips, damn it. Oh well, it's fine. It, it's it's already it's fine. I, it's fine. Wow. I wish it I wish it were that easy to get someone to want to sleep with you. Just give them cake and then they're like they're ready. Oh my god. I wish. I wish. Oh, hi, Bazaar. How are you? How are you doing? I'm reading gay books. Yay. Um, I'm almost done reading uh, the first volume of this book, so I'm actually probably going to end it soon, but I'm glad you're here. Thank you for joining me. I hope you're doing well. Are you reading anything? Let me know, because, you know, this is a reading stream. And you should read something. <laughs>
Oh my God, this is so relatable though. Oh my God, when when customers ask me questions about stuff, I'm constantly like, uh, let me go ask. <laughs> relatable, oh my God. Uh -huh. I'm doing, I'm glad you're doing well, Bizarre. I'm doing good. I'm enjoying this manga so far a lot. A lot more than I thought I would, so that's been fun. Oh my god, I love this manga so much. Oh. <sighs> oh, so great. That's so great. This is making me so hungry again, and I just ate. I'm like, I want to go get, like, something sweet now. Ah.
All right. And that's how volume two ends. Oh, there's a little bit more. There's a little extra. Hold on. Almost done. And then we'll we'll um, end the stream. Oh. Mm. What the heck? <laughs> oh my gosh. I I love these characters so much already. I love them. Who has a beer right after a hangover? Like, oh my god. Oh, anyway, that was a good first volume. I like it. Also, I really like looking at like the old um like ads in the back of these books. A lot of these I haven't read yet. Actually, most of them I haven't read yet. But I want to. Oh, I have this one I need to read, Beyond My Touch. I need to read that one, so. Yeah, I love it. I love it. I'm, I'm glad that I decided to read this today. <sighs> I'm probably gonna read volume two later, later on, but I had a lot of fun. Um, I hope you guys had fun reading with me. Um, and I hope that you all have a lovely day. Um, I'm going to sign off here. And, um, yeah, it was a lot of fun, though. So, yeah, I'll, I'll let you guys say bye, and then I'll end it. So, yay. So, yeah. Thank you for joining me, guys. Have a lovely day. Bye. Stay sexy.